clock sheet comes into the week 17 and 2 on the year 8 and 0 in league play. The Lions are just a few wins away from a Metro League title, but so are the River City Raiders. Yep, and River City's also undefeated in league at 8 and 0. Game 1 of the two game set played at River City on Wednesday. It's our second Sun Power Electric game. Mark Willis was there. Electric game. Yeah, it's safe to say that we'll find out after this week who the league champ will be. Both McClatchy and River City are undefeated this year in league, and they really haven't been tested either. The Lions have been led by their wall of a catcher, Malcolm Moore. The four-year varsity starter in All-American leads the team with a 550 batting average and is tied for fourth in homers in the nation with 12. Gabe Henderson and Julian Cremona are also doing plenty of damage at the plate for the Lions. As for the Raiders, they are led by senior Freddy Rodriguez. The Cal Poly commit is leading the team in RBIs and has a sub-1 ERA on the hill. Riley Stevens leads the team with eight wins, and Bryce Sabaki is very hard to keep off the bases. Well, that's about it. I'm super excited to bring you guys the Sun Power Electric game. Get those cameras all set up and let's get after it. Stevens on the hill for the boys in blue. Top of the first, McClatchy gets on the board. Julian Kimona shoots a ball down the left field line. Gabe Henderson comes in to score, and just like that, it's one to nothing, the Lions. Two nothing now when Mason Ogihara lifts a fly ball to the left. RC's JJ Torrent makes the catch. It's deep enough for Kimona to score from third, and the Lions lead it three zip. Gabe Henderson getting the start for McClatchy, and he looked great early on getting the whiff. Top of two now for the Lions with a runner on third. Malcolm Moore singles past the drawn in infield. Scoring from third is Brandon Silva, and it's four to nothing. With two on in the top of the third, Silva singles over the infielder's head and into right. One runs in, two runs are in, and the McClatchy Lions have broken this thing wide open 6 2 zip. In the fourth inning now, two runners on for the Lions again. Sean Lohr lays into this pitch and sends it deep to left. It falls for a double, and Henderson and Moore come in to score 8 2 nothing Lions. Fifth inning now, Lions have runners on for Gabe Henderson, and this dude gets all of that one to the windows, to the walls. This baby's gone. It's now a 10 nothing ball game. Next batter is Malcolm Moore. He steps up and sends this pitch deep into the West Sacramento baby blue skies. It's gone. His 13th on the season. That ties him for second in the nation in home runs. And that would do it as the Lions win big 11 to nothing in five innings. We caught up with Mr. Malcolm Moore after the game. We're really clicking on all cylinders. We're coming together. A lot of friends in the clubhouse. And uh, we're just having a lot of fun out here. And that's the most important thing. In West Sacramento for the Sun Power Electric game, I'm Mark Wills, 49ers Sec High Sports.